enthusiasm for the variety of excellent opportunities for young women who attend this school continues to grow. The strength of Regina Dominican is in its people, the faculty, staff, and most of all, the young women who so vibrantly participate in the many educational opportunities we offer. Each student is challenged to achieve her potential for excellence in academics, leadership, and service within the school and community. So enjoy this year in review. May God continue to bless us all.
generally like very elaborate star shape, but then I you know, used so much tape, so I kind of modified it down to this.
in the front, start, and a zipper in the back. Kelly made this beautiful coat for around $100. Super job.
Pete Rose, baseball's all-time hit leader, admitted to concealing racetrack winnings from the IRS and agreed to pay stiff fines and penalties. On September 22nd, Hurricane Hugo slammed into the coast of the Carolinas with winds near 100 miles per hour, causing massive destruction and loss of life. Dozens died and damage was in the billions when on October 17th, a massive earthquake struck the San Francisco Bay Area. Despite the devastation, experts warned this was not the major quake many feared. President Bush called for a constitutional amendment making the burning or desecration of the flag a criminal offense. The Supreme Court had earlier held the act protected by the First Amendment right of free speech. Thousands celebrated when on November 9th, the Berlin Wall dividing Germany was toppled, allowing free passage between East and West and opening the door to a reunited German nation. The Rolling Stones celebrate over 25 years on the charts with a massive tour of the U.S. The band would play 60 shows in 32 cities in what was billed as the Steel Wheels Tour. On December 20th, in an effort to oust strongman dictator Manuel Noriega to face drug charges in the U.S. and to protect some 35,000 American citizens abroad, American troops invade the country of Panama. The San Francisco 49ers, behind the performance of quarterback Joe Montana, cement their reputation as the team of the decade by defeating the Denver Broncos in Super Bowl 24. As more than 100 million people worldwide took part in Earth Day, President Bush called for the banning of ships and dangerous cargo from the environmentally sensitive reefs off the Florida Keys. Ending years of debate, Soviet Premier Gorbachev and President Bush meet in Washington to sign the START Agreement to reduce nuclear arms.